So La Follette is one of the oldest residence halls on campus and uh, it's a very social and laid back environment and I mean I've met a lot of my friends here and uh, like the community is really cool. I love everyone that I've met here and uh, there's always a lot of fun activities going on but uh, I mean overall La Follette is shit. Uh, there's no air conditioning. It's far as hell from anything else on campus. Uh, it's just, it's just fucking old. But yeah, overall, that's La Follette. La Follette isn't the nicest building on campus. But it has everything that I need. It's got showers so I can stay clean. Um, it's got laundry rooms. There's only one per floor, so it's not, it doesn't help you a lot, but it's still there. It, it has an elevator. Only goes up to the sixth floor, but it works. I'm about to go get my laundry. I literally waited four hours to get a spot. biggest downfall of La Follette, in my opinion, is uh, the bathrooms. They are just not very clean or private. <laughs> so uh, these are the bathrooms. As you can tell, they are not very clean. Um, and over here are the showers. And um, yeah, I mean, there's not a lot of privacy because there's just little curtains. Like someone could like easily walk up and just be like, ah! sorry. I used to live in the Johnson Complex, and it was really nice. But since becoming an RA, they put me in La Follette. It's great, but the problem I face is having to enforce quiet hours. And it's really difficult because the walls are so thin, and I always, I always have to go out there and tell them to... I have to tell... Hey, do you mind... The Follett. Would I recommend living here? Hell no. But I can honestly say that it is, overall, it, it's a great experience. It's, it's, it's an experience of a lifetime. So.